Guys, the shirt's 800. <laughs> guys, 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 800. Embrace your roots design and the icon shirt. Over here. <laughs> show so much respect to the theater because this is an art form <laughs> and all of you are now involved in this art form so what I need you to do is when I ask you to put your hands together to give a big round of applause to our next performers I want you to give your most theatrical clap and together when I raise the name of the next two performers you will read it out loud all together can we do that yeah. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, let's hear the clapping. Let's set some scenes. The most theatrical Let us now call on stage. Five years ago, um, uh, Spit performed in the Chicago Improv Festival. And Jonathan, uh, he was, is the producer of the Chicago Improv Festival. And uh, we sent our application in. We actually got one of our friends to recommend us. And he welcomed us. Um, he, one of the most memorable things, of course, the, the festival was amazing. Chicago is the epicenter of uh, improv, and we were so nervous just performing there, and one of the, uh, he did many wonderful things for us, but one of the most memorable things was he asked us to guest in a uh, Chicago radio show. <laughs> and it was like, uh, you know, we had to be there at six in the morning, and the radio show was like a shock jock radio show. It's like, uh, ha like Howard Stern. Stern. Howard Stern, so it was a shock radio show. And when we went there, they didn't even interview us about improv. They asked us to play um, random, strange, stereotyped Asians who were squealing in the background while another person was interviewed. Uh, speaking of random stereotypes, I'm an American. <laughs> Uh, I want to say that it is a blessing to be here. When I look at all these faces, and I look at all of you, and I am here, and I traveled over 8,000 miles to be here, it is for moments like this. It is amazing, and I am thankful to be part of the Manila Improv Festival, and I'm thankful to Gabe, and I'm thankful to everyone on it. This is just amazing. It is a blessing to be here. Thank you. We have no format. Uh, we're, we're just going to improvise. We're just looking at all of you listening to the shows, and we're just going to improvise. So, Jonathan and Gabe.
you're a much better fisherman than me. Oh. I haven't even caught a fish yet. And the boobies. I'm really good at that. The boobies, I have nothing in my nets also. So. <laughs> I mean, I cast a white net. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> So many of us get an education, so many of us get a job, and the ultimate dream for the Filipino is to leave. What? Our ultimate dream, if you're successful in life, is to leave. That doesn't to go make to America. That, oh, that just doesn't make any sense to me. Like, if you have a dream, it should fulfill you, not make you go away. Dorothy was fighting to return home. <laughs> she wasn't leaving Kansas to go to Oz so she could work as a counter girl. Yeah, but <laughs> sometimes a lot of us don't feel like this is home anymore. Oh. Yeah, Paul. I think they're going to foreclose on our shack. 
pinapatalsik kami sa mga lupa na sinasaka namin. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Kasi sa isla ng Negros kayo weekend lang, labing apat ang pinatay. Walang awang pinatay ng mga sundalo, ng militar sa sarili nating bayan. Pinagbabaril. At tayo walang kainik-inik. Sarili nating bayan, pinapatay ang mga tao natin. No, Paul, I love when you speak from your heart like that. Kasi <laughs> walang puso na talaga para nangyayari sa atin. Para, oh, okay, sige yan, mga tao ang pinapatay, pero <laughs> minsan pa... Not that bad, Paul. Don't let it hurt you. Wala, bad vibes lang yan. Huwag mong sabihin yan. Ganyan lang talaga ngayon. Huwag na natin pag-usapan. Wow, change is coming. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the change is we're going to lose the shed. But we still got each other, Paul. Minsan ang labo eh. Minsan parang mas nagkakaintindihan pa tayo. Nakikipag-intindihan pa tayo sa mga banyaga. Wow, okay, bibisita tayo. Okay, welcome. Let's visit the Philippines. This is a great place. Let's enjoy. Pero sarili tayo, tayo mismo, nag-aaway tayo. Ayaw natin yung... Ay, 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 ayaw natin, sa sinasabi natin, ah, mga dilawan, mga gago yan. Ah, mga dutetag, wala yan. Parang, wow, wow, wow. Ang ganda na mukha na pinapakita natin sa mga bisita. Pero sa sarili, sa isa't isa, nag-aaway tayo. Ang gugulo tayo. Ayaw natin ang isa't isa. No, Paul, you said that so much better than I could have. <laughs> But it hurts me to see you sad like that. It hurts me to see you like dancing on the edge of bitterness. Hindi ko alam kung malungkot ako o galit. At kung galit man ako, hindi ko alam kung kanino o galit. Uh, we find somewhere else to live. Don't have to be here no more. Sana ganun kadali. Sana ganun kadali ka mo yun. Yung passport mo, Philippine passport. Diba? Philippine passport. Saan ka pwede magpunta? Saan ka pwede magpunta? Saan tinatanggap ba yung mga passport natin? Saan tinatanggap? Where can we go? Wow. Uh, <laughs> They keep feeding me. <laughs> <laughs> I am just out here finding my own business and they keep throwing my cousins at me. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Habulin 
Wanted a pet, Dad. I know. Thank you. You're very welcome, son. Glad we found something you're not allergic to. <laughs> <laughs> you have allergies with dust mites and everything else. That's why we keep you away from Australia. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 That's very thoughtful. Well, you're welcome. And uh, see, you now have a pet. Hang on. There's a little wagon. Now you can take your pet for a walk. <laughs> and there's a baseball bat for when the kids make fun of you. Thank you, Dad. This every Thank other weekend so thing is going to be so good. Oh. You know, Dad, I... I... I'm really proud of you, son. Mm. You're the only son I have. So mathematically, <laughs> I'm really proud of you. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. I don't just buy goldfish and... and let, 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 let me talk. <laughs> a bad dad. No, no, you're not a bad dad. Just, just sometimes I don't want to talk and sometimes I just want to... Just leave it. Leave it. I mean... Right. We'll just be. That, I mean, we talk all the time. You, you FaceTime me every night. I mean, even if, ever since mom and I moved away, I mean, you, you, you've been there. You FaceTime me to say goodnight. You text me in the morning. I just miss you just being there. You know, sometimes I... Sometimes, and even when I'm playing my games, when I'm playing Overwatch and Fortnite, <laughs> I, I don't want you to talk to me. I just want you to just be in the room. Okay, we won't talk. We'll just be in the room. Thanks, Dad. You need to do do. <laughs>